Okay, you're now in a position where you're ready to sell your home. The first thing you're gonna to wanna to consider is your timeline, as this will help the agent determine what the most appropriate sale method will be for you. The next thing you're gonna to wanna to consider is interviewing agents. Now, I don't mean in a traditional way where they come in and sit down with you, but you could actually go to their open homes or make some inquiries on properties they have and see how they handle that inquiry. The next thing you wanna consider is your changeover costs. This can include settlement fees, stamp duty, capital gains if you're selling an investment, or even paying a real estate agent. If you're selling an investment property, it's important to speak to your accountant before you list your property. The reason being is that they'll be able to determine if making the sale is the right decision for now, and also if you're waiting for your accountant to get back to you at a later date, you could actually lose the buyer. The final thing you're going to want to consider is your bottom dollar, otherwise known as a reserve. It's important to get very clear about that prior to a contract coming in, taking into account changeover costs as well. That way, when you get into a position with a contract in front of you, you're in a position where you can sell. Thank you for joining me on this week's quick tip. If you need any assistance from a real estate perspective, please don't hesitate to contact me, Jordan James. Mm -hmm.